Hi guys, Barnaby for Spurred On. I'm on the Eurostar. This is another edition of Six O'Clock Spurs. We've just got back into London from that incredibly depressing trip to Belgium after last night's loss 2-1 to Anderlecht. So let's get some news out the way. What's been happening today? Well, I can tell you that the Daily Mail report that we are in for Eden Hazard's brother, Thorgan Hazard. Now, this isn't the first time this rumour has surfaced. He actually left Chelsea in the summer to go to Borussia Mönchengladbach in Germany for £5.9 million. He's an attacking midfielder. He's been doing really well over in the Bundesliga and so the Daily Mail are bringing up that rumour again. I'm not sure if there's much in it. Is he a Paul Mitchell kind of signing? Remains to be seen. Let us know what you think in the comment section below. Also today, ex-Liverpool and Ireland legend Ray Houghton has been waxing lyrical about Moussa Dembele to talk sport. He says he's a big fan of the player but just feels that he's lacking a bit of confidence when he plays at the moment. Now we know he played well, in fact brilliantly against Liverpool the other week but last night he was kind of back to his former self with a bit of, bit of a scratchy display. Houghton thinks he should be playing more one and two touch stuff, getting himself into some more attacking positions and getting more shots off at goal and if he does that he could become the player that we all know he's got the talent to be. And the final bit of news today is that Eric Dyer has done a big interview for Football Focus that will be on tomorrow morning on BBC One. Uh, he's uh, basically talked about what it was like growing up in the Football Academy at Sporting Lisbon, talks about how he feels he's still kind of a foreign player trying to acclimatise to the Premier League. He also talks about what it's like when he was facing Diego Costa last year in the Carling Cup final, which of course is now known as the Capital One Cup final. He talked about how he spoke to him in Portugal and he doesn't think that fighting fire with fire with Diego Costa is the way to go. He doesn't think you should make him angry. He actually says that he just spoke to him in Portuguese throughout the game and had a bit of a laugh with him and told him how much he liked him, which sounds like it could be something that a lot of defenders could learn. What do you guys think of Eric Dyer? I personally think he's our best young player, most talented, kind of old school throwback we've had for a long time. And it's a delight to have him in the team, especially in this new central defensive midfield position that he's making his own. But let us know in the comment section below what you think of him and all the other news we've had today. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube and follow us on Twitter at Spurred on TV. Come on you Spurs. Hi guys, Barnaby for Spurred on. I am at uh, Anderlecht Metro Station. Just come out of the ground, done our fan cams. We lost 2-1 obviously and this is my post-match review.